The clock is ticking. Stellantis' brands face a brutal 2026 deadline, and survival is not guaranteed. It turns out the 14 brands under Stellantis' sprawling empire are in for a rude awakening. The comfortable 10-year grace period Stellantis promised back in 2021? Forget about it. CEO Carlos Tavares just dropped a bombshell this week. These brands will have to prove their worth by 2026, a full five years earlier than expected. In other words, the financial lifeline will be cut, and it's every brand for itself. While each of these brands may have glossy product plans stretching to 2031, the ugly truth is this. The money runs dry in 2026. After that, it is survival of the fittest race here. And let's be real, some of these brands are already on thin ice. Tavares, in a candid interview at the Paris Auto Show, didn't mince words. He made it clear that the reviews start soon. He says, we will review each brand's performance at about two-thirds of the way through their Dare Forward 2030 plan. So you can expect decisions in the next two or three years. Translation, some of these brands won't make it. While Stellantis claims that product launches are still on track for now, Tavares hinted at the inevitable. Some launches might just be rearranging deck chairs on the Titanic. Let that sink in for a moment. As if the 2026 deadline wasn't enough, he also announced his own impending retirement at the end of his contract in early 2026. How convenient. After years of dodging bullets from U.S. dealers, unions, and critics, Tavares will bow out before the real chaos begins. He'll escape the fallout, but his successor won't be so lucky. The incoming CEO will inherit a ticking time bomb tasked with deciding which of Stellantis' 14 brands will survive, which will be cut, sold off, or tossed in the scrap heap of automotive history. It's a mess waiting to happen, and with only two years left to find a new leader, Stellantis is in a race against time. The new CEO will have to make the hard calls, whether it's cutting dead weight or merging brands into obscurity. Either way, someone's getting axed. Stellantis is currently juggling 14 brands, including Abarth, Alfa Romeo, Chrysler, Dodge, Fiat, Jeep, Maserati, Peugeot, Ram, and others. A bloated lineup with too many mouths to feed. By 2026, when the money dries up, some of these brands will be left starving. The question isn't if, but who will be the first to go? Tavares can promise all the product launches and growth plans he wants, but with cash running thin, the weaker links are bound to be exposed. Some of these brands won't be able to keep up. They'll be tossed overboard just to keep the rest of them afloat. In a curious twist, Stellantis chairman John Elkin was quick to dismiss any ideas of mergers or acquisitions at the Paris Auto Show. Despite the impending storm, Elkin confidently stated, we're not ready to consolidate, but we're not ready to deconsolidate. This is not the time for that. Really? Because from where we're standing here in the audience, Stellantis looks like a house of cards on the verge of collapsing under its own weight. Elkin went on to claim that the upcoming leadership shakeup was all part of Tavares' master plan. Sure, but what he conveniently left out is that Tavares will walk away before the real reckoning hits. The new CEO will be handed a sinking ship, and Elkin's words feel more like damage control than a real plan. With 2026 looming, Stellantis is facing a harsh reality. The 14 brands under their umbrella are in a race for survival. And the brutal truth is this, not all of them will make it. As the money runs out and leadership changes hands, some of these iconic brands could be gone forever. While the public is fed promises of a bright future, behind the scenes, the countdown has already begun. Stellantis may have once promised a decade of stability, but now it's just two years of desperation, and scrambling to survive. On that note, if and when you are ready to buy a vehicle, a non-Stellantis vehicle probably, uh, visit quotes.everymandriver.com for the best deals being advertised in your zip code from qualified dealerships. Make model in zip code to find the best deals. If you don't find what you're looking for in your zip code, expand that zip code. If you're willing to travel a few miles outside your area, you could save and most likely save a few hundred, possibly a few thousand dollars on a new car, truck, or SUV by visiting quotes.everymandriver.com. is a free search engine. There's also a direct link below this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay updated with the latest insights from the automotive world. Hope to see you next time. Today's video is brought to you by The Cold Plunge. Use discount code DAVE150 at checkout at thecoldplunge.com. Immediately save $150 off your purchase. That's DAVE150 at thecoldplunge.com. There's also a link below this video.